Hello, Zany friends. I am Marshall. And I am Lainey. And today we have kind of a different subscription box subscription for you. Um, I have actually gotten this subscription for a month so far. This would be my second month. And it doesn't really change month to month. So we decided we would test it out and uh, bring it to you. It is called Kitty Poo Club. So if you have cats, this might be a subscription for you. Uh, this is what it looks like. You're going to be in charge of holding stuff up there. So it comes in a box that is flat, just like this. And what this box does is it becomes your cat's litter box. It's made out of cardboard and it basically pops up. We're going to show you how it works right now. So you take the lid off. And then we only did put the tape off one side, but normally you would take the lid off and fold it underneath. We're not going to do that right now because I haven't set this up yet. So when you get to the inside of this box, it basically comes with the box. And then on the inside, it comes with this like silica litter. And then the bottom of the box actually has this like plastic lining. You can kind of see it right here, um, which keeps it from soaking all the way through the box. So basically, let me tell you first about what this, how this works. You can decide how often you get this box. For the first month, we got our box for four weeks. And I have to say that for our cat in particular, we needed it every three weeks. And so you can change it for three weeks. You can change it for two months if you want. Um, the price of this box, just what I got, which is the box and the litter on the inside, is $20. Now, for me personally, it's worth it. It is, it's totally worth it to use something like this and to pay $20 for it. I would probably be spending that much on litter a month anyway. Um, the reason why I kind of like this option is because it's a silica, it is, uh, not does not have dust when you pour it in or scoop it um the pee actually goes into the silica rocks and uh, it is absorbed there is if you don't go in and like stir the silica every night it does start to get a little stinky but if you go in and stir it and remove the poop itself it maintains its freshness for i think at least three weeks um i think after the last week it started getting a little too much we also have a uh litter genie where we scoop the poop and we put it in in a bag inside of a plastic container so we can't smell it after that um so like i said this this particular box once you're done with it will you just fold it back up put the lid on toss it so now that we've gotten this we can um, just throw out my old one away. Once we get this set up, and uh, right here I'm going to put a picture of what it looks like once it's set up. I do have like a, a dome that fits on top of this for my cat that you can replace. So like I take it off my old one, I put it on a new one. It is made of cardboard as well, which he loves because he loves to scratch the cardboard. Um, so some cons about this before I tell you what else you can get with this. Some cons are that my cat when I first gave him this, he didn't really know what to make of it. And he took his paw and went like this, like he was trying to dig and it made rocks go all over the floor. The rocks are not comfortable when you step on them. So if you're going to place this somewhere and if you have room, place it in a room of the house where it doesn't have a lot of traffic because we keep our kitty box in the bathroom because that's basically the only place we can. And I'm stepping on rocks a lot. So uh, they don't hurt. They're just kind of a nuisance, you know, that you're stepping on rocks. But I step on litter anyway when, before we, like, sweep it, and he makes a mess, right? I did hear one strategy that sometimes helps with that is to, when you're switching out what kind of litter you're using, put the old litter on top of it so that as he's digging through and using it, he's yeah. getting the idea, oh, this stuff is the same stuff. Yeah, exactly. Um, so for this, I spend twenty one forty. what is it, twenty one forty nine. Um, and it's going to come every three weeks and it just basically is the box and the silica. You can get other things as well. Um, you can add multiple litter boxes and bags if you need it. You can add the dome, which is about $4, but you don't have to get a new dome every month unless you want it. In fact, you have to add it on. So that's a great thing. It's, it's not like a hidden cost that they just keep sending you and you don't know about it. Um, they also, uh, you can add a scoop 
if you want to get a new scoop every month for two dollars more and then they have this thing which i kind of thought i was getting but i guess i'm not called tiki sticks they it's like a new thing that they're adding which is like a cat treat um and i was thought I was supposed to get a sample, I might get it in my next box, but they are offering that as well for $4.29 for a six pack. So no, I didn't get any of those. Um, if I have a referral link for you, I will leave it down below to see if you can save some money. I might have a coupon somewhere that I'm just not seeing on the site, um, but I can put that down below. So again, if you are a, an owner of cats, this might be something for you. Uh, what I do like about it too is that if you're like me, you have one of those plastic kitty litter boxes and it's great you know you have to change your litter all the time but it is kind of gross sometimes too like even after you're taking the litter out sometimes you have to wash it down and it gets to be just this hassle so for, for me having something like this is a very easy to just clean it and go get rid mm -hmm. of it at the end of the month and you don't even have to worry about that kind of thing it's actually really nice and recyclable from what i understand the uh, even the liner was made out of recycled materials mm -hmm. and so you can recycle it will be recycled again perhaps mm -hmm. and they do say that the designs on the box change throughout the season so right now it's these really cute kitties in the inner tube so i'm guessing that's the summer and uh you know we it might be a different one for fall and then winter so i'm kind of excited for that too i mean yes it's cardboard but you know your cat pees on it so <laughs> it doesn't have to be that pretty yeah. what do you think you don't use this yet for your cat right Not yet but i'm going to be pretty soon um just as soon as the current litter is no longer usable mm-hmm yep yep so that is kitty poo i just wanted to we got it like literally today and i wanted to show you guys before we have to set it up which we do need to very quickly because my old box is starting to get a little gross yes so thank you for watching uh this little thing if you like these kind of interesting subscription boxes please comment down below and let me know and maybe tell me about one you've heard of that you want us to talk about on this channel or talk about your cats what are your cats named what do they like put it down below and until next time, say Zany. Bye-bye.